Hi, I'm Sean McCauley, and this is my answer to question number nine on the exam. So here we have our graph. Um, so we've got VO2 max over here, um, and then we have the miles per hour on the treadmill, so the intensity. It goes 1, 6, 12, and then it's 500, 4,000. So the red line that we've got is the um, original version, and then I've got a um, purple-blue-ish line that goes up, and that's the corrected version. Let me tell you why it's... One's incorrect and why the other one's going to be more correct. So the red line is going to go up steadily like it should for um, as the intensity increases going up to about five miles an hour on the treadmill. But then it plateaus and then as the intensity goes up at about nine miles an hour, it drops and then it plateaus again. Um, so the reason why this is wrong is as the intensity goes up, the oxygen deficit that we find ourselves in is greater. And so it's also going to go up. And so as it goes up, it shouldn't plateau unless something's very wrong. Um, and it shouldn't go down as well. <laughs> that also means something is very wrong. And so um, that's why we have the corrected model here. So the corrected, as the intensity goes up, the VO2 levels also go up. Um, so that's why it's the one is incorrect and the other why, why the other one has been corrected. But yeah.